search teams on the ground and a helicopter in the air, all looking for any sign of a missing two-year-old boy. We're using all of our assets to uh, find William. When Chelsea Noble woke up about 10 o'clock in the morning, her child William, who had been sleeping in the bed with her, was missing. The search continued until just before 4 o'clock when 10-year-old Blake Carroll got home from school and heard a child crying. He then saw William in an old truck. I was like in shock. I was like, like that's how my face was. I was like, everything's going to be all right. I'm going to go get my aunt. Blake's aunt and uncle, Charles and Juanita Kelly, were involved in the search for William earlier in the woods. Charles rescued William from the locked truck. So I run down there and seen him in the truck. Had to unlock the, pull the window out and reach and unlock the door to get him out. The Kellys brought William back to the area where the search efforts were centered. There, he was reunited with his mother. Thank God, my baby. That's all I can think is they got my baby. I was happy. William was following his dog. Searchers were tracking a trail of the dog's paw and William's footprints. After he was found, William was taken to the hospital and checked for any serious injuries from being in the woods for so long. He's in good shape. He's got a lot of ant bites, a lot of cuts and abrasions on him, but he's in, he's in fair shape. Sheriff Troy Peterson called the outcome of the search phenomenal. Ultimately, William is safe thanks to another child's discovery. I was just like, oh my gosh, I was in shock and I was like, I just saved this baby's life because he could have died from dehydration.